I figured it out. The musical gamer is a smart one. I had to go back around up to here and keep keep raising these lifts. So now that these lifts are raised, I can go up here and then back around through the bottom. If that makes any sense. Hey everybody, it's the Musical Gamer again. Welcome back to Let's Play Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne. Here in the final dungeon of the game. We are here at the altar of Kagatsuchi, the tower of Kagatsuchi itself. And we're here to, well, kick some ass. Eh, oh, I should have used my Bufudine. Oops. Oh well. Eh, oh, this won't be too bad. He just healed himself, meaning he's going to die really easily. And lovely, lovely experience, money, and the like. Cool. We can now go through here. Oh, not certs. I really kind of just want to run from this. But I will fight. I will fight for it. It's in my blood. Uh, also, what I could probably do is uh, let's skip your turn. And let's actually start using this chakra elixir. Could uh, do with giving Pale Rider some MP back. Yeah, that's nice. Does that? Yeah, I can. I can take a friggin' hit. Are you kidding me? Punch you in the face. Let's use this again. Uh, this time on Dante. Haha! -ha! Beautiful. Oh, he's dead. That was short-lived, wasn't it, Cert? Managed to just abuse you for some quick MP healing. Um, that was kind of pointless, but at the very least, we got a bead out of it. So hey, it's <laughs> it's something, I suppose. Uh, hmm. I don't know. What was it I was supposed to do here? Never mind, I didn't figure out this puzzle. Hang on, let me look at this. Let me look at this real quickly. Or get into another battle. Let's just look at this real quickly. Okay, so that is that. Um. Hmm. Because now this thing has been raised. And I can now lower these. Aha! No, I did have to do all that. Alright. Fair enough. I I did figure it out. I just only figured out half of it when I cut the video in. Ha! Well. Suppose that does work. Because now that that's up, this is down. We can now go this way. Duly noted. Oh god. Whew. Had to, gotta cut that out. I sneezed like a friggin' banshee there. Because uh, uh, apparently banshees can sneeze. Oh, hello there. When the other leaders are making their way up, why is Commander Hikawa not moving? Is he waiting for the demi fiend? Well. If he is, how thoughtful of him. Because I would like to have a couple of words with Hikawa myself. Uh, oh, this place has been connected now. Not really what I'm interested in, though. I suppose the other way will have a similar elevator. I'm assuming, yeah, there's one right there. What's through the door? A soul. The tower is filled with the power of Kagetsuchi. It's so strong, the higher levels aren't being formed properly. Really? What is that supposed to mean? Oh, don't tell me there's gonna be more friggin' block puzzles. If that's what that means, I am not looking forward to it. The effect of Repel has worn off. Duly noted. Uh, no, I am not fighting you. Alright. 
to the next floor. Doo doo. Uh, let's go to the right. Ah, okay, there's a mystical chest here. Uh, since I'm here, I might as well grab it, so I'll see you guys in a second once we're at full Gakatsuchi. Alright, there we go. What's in the chest? A chakra pot. Alright, cool. I'll take the chakra pot, gladly. Even though I have the chakra elixir... Uh, MP restoring items isn't really much of a concern anymore. Though, chakra pots are still useful because of the amount of MP they're able to restore. The chakra elixir is basically the um, equivalent of a chakra drop, I think? Is it a chakra drop? Drop? What's the... Um... Yeah, it's basically a reusable chakra drop is all it is. So, chakra pots and great chakras are still very useful. Which, you know, is kind of convenient that they kept it there, at the very least. Uh, which is the block I want to take here? Hmm. Uh, I think this one? Yeah, most definitely, considering it brought me to a terminal. Uh, let's actually save our game here, while we're, uh, while we're thinking about it. Might as well. And there we go. Game saved. Don't really want anything to happen to the progress I've already made. Alright. Let's go take the other lift this time. And I'm assuming it will take us right up here. And I see some stairs over there. Yep, stairs. Lovely, lovely stairs. We shall climb the stairs to the 211th floor. Dear Lord. Hello. I saw an incredible demon up ahead. It's big. It's red. Is it still there? Oh, I've got a bad feeling about this one. I have a very bad feeling about this one. And of course, these things in front of me are not helping one little bit. None of them actually attacked me. So can I just run? Thank you. Whew. Okay. Let's go up the elevator. Um, let's do a quick little shimmy shammy of the party. Let's, uh, who, who should I put back in stock? That is the question. Um, what is Pale Rider useful for? I mean, he does have Mediorama, but so does Albion. You know, to be completely honest, he's not really got- He does not really have anything I particularly want for this. Kills all sleeping targets instantly. All enemies. Okay. Um, yeah. Pale Rider. Sorry, but no. Guess what? Fudo Mimi! You're up! Yeah, I know I haven't really used you yet. Uh, how are you doing on experience? You're actually about to level up. <laughs> so, uh, congrats? Okay. I've got Vimana on. Let's actually ingest Kamudo. Oh boy. Alright. Not you. Since you're not going to be used, just do a quick heal. All right, a strong power from beyond the door. Will we enter? Yes, indeed we will. This will be a pretty long video.
who stirs the silence, who opposes the coming of the kingdom of Shijima. It is you. You have great strength. Your ideals, however, stand at odds with my own. Vile deceiver! I shall destroy you and erase your despicable greed! Oh, Jesus. And it's boss time. Against the one, the only, god of Shijima, the world of silence, Aramon. Amuse me with your strength, evil one, before eternal silence is upon us. If you do not heed my words, then I shall send you to hell. This is but a game. Oh, breaking the fourth wall. Physical attacks are forbidden. You do well to heed his advice. This is the tyrant Aramon, Hikawa's god, and the god of Shijima, the reason of silence. His gimmick for this battle is he will issue a command every once in a while, and you must adhere to his command. So he said no physical attacks. If we do if anybody uses a physical attack, attack, he will immediately cast a move called Hell's Call, which will immediately kill whoever went against his wishes. So, to start, let's, uh, <laughs> let's provoke him a little bit. Lower his defense. Raise his attack, unfortunately. I uh, didn't really want to raise his attack, but I have no choice there. Dekaja. Uh, actually, yeah, I can use Dekaja here. So I'll do that, and I will have Futomimi use Warcry. Weakening his physical and magical attacks. Yes, I now finally have... I finally have War Cry, which is why Fudo Mimi's being used here. Ow! Oh God! Whew! Oh boy! Uh, oh, I should go over his stats, shouldn't I? He's got 6,000 HP, 3,000 MP. He has no resistances, no weaknesses. He repels, expel, and death, and voids curse, nerve, and mind. Relatively simple, relatively straightforward. Um, yes, let's provoke him again. The difference this time is I'm going to use Fog Breath. War Cry will bring him back down to where he was before. Albion can use Tarunda. There. Aragadine? Not too tr troubling right there. Okay, I don't need to use that anymore. However, I still cannot use any physical attacks. So, let's use... Actually, no, let's skip your turn, Dante. As for me... Um, another Fog Breath would probably be helpful. Fudomimi. Do you even have any... You do have magic. Yeah, let's just use Agadine, then. 428, wow. Okay, we're doing a lot of damage. Um... Hmm. Taruda. Boom. Okay. I think we're set in terms of all of that stuff. So, let's use Magma Axis, the new move I got. It actually costs HP to use, but it is a magic attack. Look at that. 657 damage. <laughs> Let us continue. Spell attacks are forbidden. And now we get to the part of the battle where I will excel at, considering I am a pro when it comes to physical attacks. Let's use... <laughs> let's use Rebellion here. For Dante. Ooh, nice crit. Focus. You know, Mimi, I will have you lunch, my good sir in the face. Uh, Hades Blast would be good if there was more than one opponent. Sadly, there isn't here. I'm gonna have you skip. I'm going to just punch you and do over a thousand damage. Hmm. <laughs> Let us continue. Spells and items. Oh god, spells and items are forbidden. You know what? Screw it. I'm just gonna auto this part right now. 
what's next. All except physical attacks are forbidden. Ah! Stop doing that! And when he says all, he even means healing spells. <laughs> Enough of this game. Games are meaningless in a world of silence. Now you shall meet your doom. Oh god, here we go. Time for the real battle. Say hello to the real Aramon. In this form, he's got 18,000 HP, 6,000 MP. He still has no weaknesses and resistances, repels, expel, and death, and voids curse, nerve, and mind. He will no longer put any restrictions on us. However, the HP boost is enormous. So, yeah. However, thanks to all of these buffs and debuffs, we should be able to get him relatively quickly um, and without much issue. But that is a, that is just a hope. Really, not so much a guarantee. And he can do this. Megadoleon. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, good, but we most of us dodged. All right, Dante, let's see if you can get a crit. And you can, cool. I don't get a crit, but I do that much damage. I'm not gonna complain. Wow, okay, Fudomimi did that much damage. Holy crap in... Oh, sweet Jesus in a handbasket. That was a lot of damage. I'll skip your turn, Dante, just to focus again. Wow. Yeah, this could go pretty quickly. He will, once his HP gets low enough, he will use Dakunda. So... Do as much damage as quickly as possible. Oh, no crit, unfortunately. Oh, but I got the crit! Uh... No complaints here. Rebellion, go! Slash him in the face! Get a critical hit. So I can focus. And now Fudomimi and myself will be able to punch him in the face really, really hard. Oh god, Apocalypse. This is a signature move. It's another unblockable almighty attack. And yeah, it does a lot of damage. Uh, oh god, you can't use... Damn, you can't even use, uh... Rebellion. I guess just do that. Um, as for me, good. Lunch? Oh, nice crit. We needed that. Lord in heaven, did we need that. Uh, I will skip that turn just so I can use a... I guess a bead on Dante. I've got 45 of the goddamn things. I might as well use them. This is the end of the game, after all. Nothing says end of the game like... Using all of the items you've been hoarding throughout the entire playthrough. That is not even a understatement. Use that focus. Use that focus as well. Um, you know what, Albion? You skip your turn. We'll throw up another re do another rebellion over a crit. And we got it. How much damage? I keep. Ooh, he's. Uh, ooh, he's hurt. He is limping now. E Ow. Oh, we all got hit by that. Oh, no. <laughs> Whew. Okay. I was the only one who got hurt by that. 547. You know what? I'm gonna do something that's probably intelligent here. I'm gonna use a bead chain. Just to be safe, I got five more of them, and if I really wanted to, I can go get some more. I'm pretty sure I have enough gems to do that. Oh, it was an apocalypse again. 
because he's just gonna be spamming this like every turn now. Ow. Ha ha. You hit the one guy that you couldn't hurt with that move. 826. Uh, Fudo maybe focused, right? I think he did. Yeah, he did. Oh boy, did he. If this is a crit, we might kill him this turn. Oh, yep. There, we got him. Nice. That, uh, that actually went a lot quicker than I thought it would. And like all good bosses, he dies in a giant fiery explosion. And Fudomimi leveled up. So did Black Rider, apparently. Uh, Mana Surge. Do I even want to raise his max hit? Nah. Not really. Good move, but I got better moves. Ooh, Megadola Rock. Nice. The Rider leveled up and learned Blight. Yes, I will listen. Give me a free Chakra Drop. You learned Might. That raises your odds of, yeah, crit. I will get rid of Mute Gaze for that. It's so quiet. Too quiet. I see. The stillness has come for me. Wielder of strength. Champion of want. Mold the world to your liking. It is no longer of my concern. And we obtained the Earth Stone. That takes care of that. We've defeated Hikawa. And we get to move on. What other sort of challenges will await us here in the Tower of Kagatsuchi? Well, only one way to find out. This is the Musical Gamer signing off. See you guys next video.